Hey miners, Rusty Miner coming at you. We got ourselves a brand spotlight on the brand Rough Rider. This is the copper swirl knife. And it's pretty interesting. We got black acrylic handles and they got genuine copper swirls in them. It's got an excellent box. This is pretty high level box here. And it says always high quality handmade knives. So let's take a peek to wonder if we got a model number. Yes, we do. RR2062. So this knife is actually called a cub. And we'll get into that in a second. But just so you know, I was trying to push this box through and push it through, and that's not how you open it. Got a nice little magnet, and you open it up like that. How's that for presentation? Take a look at this thing. So we'll get it in here and we'll pull out the cub. And we'll just look at how the R is stamped in there. That's acrylic with the copper. And the other side, and it's a lock blade. Lock back. I think the fit and finish is good. These Rough Riders are pretty good, and I think this one was in that $15 range. I'll put it in the description. So, it's a nail nick knife. So you can, I don't have nails, but you put, put in there. Thank goodness I can grab it like so. Alright, you guys are going, Rusty, what are you doing with a knife that size? <laughs> well, it's, it's a fifth pocket knife. Well, it's a fifth pocket, right? It's that little pocket above in your jeans above the pocket I might call it your coin pocket a lot of times so uh, just so you can have something with you you'd be surprised this thing might get some work done not any kind of batoning or anything but you need a little knife it's got a move forward position kind of comfortable and let's see, this should have 440A. Let's go ahead and take a peek. Model number there. 440 Razor Sharp Steel. Well, I had one of these uh, already tested that wasn't razor sharp, but it did do the get the work done. This one's better. Okay. A little hang up, a little hang up. So, needs a little touch up. It's a soft steel, shouldn't be too hard to do. And how's the foam peanut test? All right, get a little bit kind of interesting on these knives. You guys can tell right where the the apex. Remember way back on those knife science videos, uh, right there they got it right, and the rest of it just not quite right so let's go ahead and bring out like the rat one you guys get an idea not a big knife here at all but it's a pretty knife and as far as uh rough riders go i'm, I'm glad to have this one in my collection and we'll just kind of push down here well, let's check out the lock yes it's uh it's snug guys so wipe this blade off looking good close her up Ooh, jolly does this he likes to see what they do when they where they start to snap close what kind of pull they got looks good so i'm happy to have this and uh, you guys can check it out if you want. Got mine off of Smoky Mountain Knife Works. I think I might be customer of the month here. All right, thanks for checking out the channel.